Got $1,500 to spare? Well, come on down to 3 by one on Mercer Street, where you can customize your pants for a price. 3 by one founder, Scott Morrison, is going to take us on a tour of his downtown denim factory. We make jeans for discriminating customers of all kinds. Um, they're basically all made here in our atelier. We make about 20 to 25 pair per day. What you see behind us is basically some of the different denim rolls and the assortment of denim. We have over 135 different denims. People are just scaling back in all types of ways. How do you justify selling $800 jeans? What we're trying to do here isn't necessarily for everyone. Um, and what we're really trying to do is we're trying to offer people something that they can't get anywhere else. A chance to customize your jean or pick your fabric or you know, create a fit that's something totally unique to you. It's Everybody wears jeans it's, it's, and it's, it doesn't it's, matter the, the brand of jeans or where you get them. If you like them, I think, uh, well, it's like worth them. it to me. Yes. It's worth it to me because it's not a, it's not that everyone doesn't have the pair of jeans, but it's worth it to me because it's the pair of jeans I wanted and I liked it exactly what I wanted. We also do cutting and we do the sewing in here. So everything is one garment, is one sewer. Mm -hmm. and what you're seeing here is a variety of different products being worked on. Uh, you're also seeing some of the threads that we different we use as well as some of the patterns over in the back wall. I believe we have some Tony Parker buttons here. <laughs> yeah. It's his basketball jersey. Number, she says TP9 on it. Is there anything you won't make? I know we've discussed before and you're not exactly a jeggings fan. Yeah, not a big fan of jeggings. I think you'll see an occasional shirt from us or a denim dress. But we're going to stay away from you know things like sweaters and knitwear and things like that. And no jeggings. No jeggings. <laughs> Reporting from downtown, this is Dana Schuster with the New York Post.